Hey guys, what's up? Lucas here. Uh, so I got a little bit of a rumor that I've just found out about. Um, well, I found out about it earlier today, but I haven't been home to make a video about it. This is this article is from uh, from RingsideNews.com, I believe it was on Facebook, and it says apparently there's a rumor going around on Reddit about the <laughs> return this Sunday at WWE Battleground. Brian Alvarez mentioned on today's installment of Wrestling Observer Live that we could in fact see the Undertaker return. <clears throat> to the company due to the WWE Network numbers being released later this month and the company wanting to have higher, have a higher number. Alvarez also mentioned that the company could use him to set up something for the SummerSlam event. Now, personally, I would love to see The Undertaker wrestle SummerSlam and come back, you know, for something. There was a lot of mention of him um, in the last uh, episode of Raw, so it could be something where, you know... I don't know exactly how they would do it, but maybe, um, he comes and helps Seth Rollins or something, I don't know, um, or even attacks Seth Rollins for not helping Kane, um, something like that. It would be really cool to see, um, him come back and do something like that, um, but yeah, I'm not, I'm not really sure where to go with this. Uh, except for that it is going to be really cool to see The Undertaker come back and wrestle. There are rumors of him retiring at uh, WrestleMania, this next year, WrestleMania 32 in Dallas. So, you know, maybe he wants to do one last, you know, kind of run in the WWE before he actually does retire, um, which it'd be cool to see him uh, come back and raise hell for a few months, and or a month at least, and then disappear, come back in time for Mania, you know, they could do it where they set up something for Mania as well, um, but yeah, anyway, that's about it for this video, hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll catch you guys next time.